fast. new brakes on my bike. It's second on my to-do list. What's first? Finding my to-do list. <laughs> anyway, I owe you one for covering for me at practice. No problem. Any chance to get to it today? I'll get right on it. Appreciate it, man. Here's my spare key. Your bike will be back in your spot when it's done. You got the Bosco guarantee. <laughs> okay, good. Later, buddy. Hey, Rico. Oh, hi, Claudia. Hey, I just got some new stuff in. You want to try it with me? Nah, I can't. I got to fix Hammer's bike. You sure? No lie, this stuff is the bomb. Yeah? No, no, but thanks. Come on. I'm going out to try it right now. A couple of hits and then do what you gotta do. I really shouldn't. Yeah. I could fix the bike later. Hey, Claudia, wait up! Find out anything? Yeah. I gotta start working out. <laughs> oh no, where's the car? It's gone. I know it's gone, that's why I asked. What if it was stolen? Or what if they took it to a chop shop? Next thing you know, chop, there's Christy. Chop, there's Christy. Chop, there's Christy. What do we do? What do we do? First, stop shaking me. <laughs> Let's call the police. This stuff, <coughs> it's great. Thanks, Claudia. Anytime. I'm really wasted. Wait, I came out to do something. What was it? Oh, ice cream, yeah. <laughs> Your station for New England's best breaking news coverage. The news station, 7 News. Hey, Reed, guess what? They just posted the grades on our science test. I do. You passed. Barely. How'd you do that? You never opened a book. I did that last year. The first time I took the class. <laughs> Guys, did you hear what happened to Hammer? He had a motorcycle accident. What? I I is he okay? They say he'll be all right, but he's pretty banged up. He's still in the emergency room. Did somebody hit him? No. Something went wrong with his brakes and he wiped out. Uh, are you sure it was the brakes? And that's what the police said. Rico, weren't you supposed to fix his brakes? Hey, man, don't try to blame this on me. Thanks for getting me out of the trunk, Mr. Parker. <laughs> Sorry about the loud stereo. Thank goodness you had a flat tire out that'd still be locked in there. You don't have to shout. Who's shouting? <laughs> the car's back. Christy, it's me, Mary Beth. Can you hear me? She's not answering. What if she passed out? Or even worse, what if she... Oh, I can't even say it. What are we gonna do? You really gotta stop shaking me. I'm sorry. I told you I'm no good with panic. We need some tools. Yes, tools. Don't let this car go anywhere. Hang on, Christy. We'll get you out of there. Just, you know, take little breaths. Little breaths. What, you never seen a guy talk to a car before? Stop! You're gonna kill her! But we've got to get her out! Look, I'll bust the lock. Okay, but hurry! What are 
are you doing to my car? Christy's lost in there. We've got to get her out before she suffocates to death. Mary Beth, can't you see I'm trying to save your life? <laughs> Christy! You're out. I'm out. You okay? I'm okay. Well, don't I feel silly? <laughs> Well, do we still pass? After what you've done to my car? <laughs> what do you think? We'll settle for a C. <laughs> think again. How about C minus? How about C, you in summer school? <laughs> Back away from my baby. Search for our easy A. Let's go. I think I need some time alone. <laughs> Just a little road rash. I'll be fine. But I'm looking for Rico. Hey, guys. Hey, Heather. I I'm sorry about your accident. How you doing? I'd be doing a lot better if some jerk I thought was my best friend had fixed my brakes like he promised. I forgot. I am sorry, okay? No. Not okay. You could have gotten me killed! I said I'm sorry! Just quit shoving me! Hey, come on, you guys! Cut it out! Come I'm lucky to be alive, no thanks to this jerk. All because he had to get high. That's, that's not true! What are you talking about, Hammer? Rico, I've known you since fourth grade, and you've never lied to me. Not till you started smoking weed. I'm telling you, I'm clean. Bull! I saw Claudia in the principal's office. She got busted. I know you smoked. Okay, I was gonna fix your bike, Hammer, uh, honest. But Claudia wanted me to try this new stuff and she wouldn't take no for an answer. Yeah, blame her. Getting high was your decision and it put me in the hospital. Rico, admit it, man, you messed up. Yeah, you lied to us. You told us you stopped smoking pot. You got to deal with this, man. You got a real problem. <laughs> we never should have covered for you with Coach. And we're not going to do it again. It only made things worse. See, you guys don't get it. Look how hard I got to work just to stay on this team. We all got to work hard. Yeah, 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 but my size. I got to work that much harder. Plus, I got pressure at home to keep my grades up. Sometimes I need just to zone out for a while. Takes the pressure off. Yeah, but Rico, getting high doesn't make your problems go away. You end up making new ones. Like what happened to me. Okay, I, I promise I'll stop you got my word. We had your word before. You've got to go to the coach. He can help you. I, I can't. He'll cut me from the team. The way you've been playing, you won't last a season. Bring it in. Let's go. So what are you going to do? You guys are right. I let all of you down. I'm sorry. Hey, Coach, can I talk to you for a minute? I, I got a problem. Oh, jeez. Did you break something of mine? <laughs> no, it's something else. I got a... I, I got a drug problem. I've been smoking pot. And I need your help. I had a feeling something was up. Michael, start running drills. Right, Coach? Am I gonna get cut from the team, Coach? Uh, are you mad? I'm not mad at you. I'm glad you came to me. It takes guts to face up to this kind of a problem. But you got to be drug free to play. That's what I want. Come on, son, let's go talk. What's the act? TNBC share their thoughts on staying safe from the TNBC confessional. I was followed in a parking lot once. Pulled a gun and pointed it right at me. I don't go out alone. Never walk around like late at night by yourself. Well, I just ran right out of there. You just have to go with your first instinct, which is like turn around and run. Stay aware of what of what's going on around you. Be aware of your surroundings. I learned to mind my own business. It doesn't matter who's wrong or who's right. You gotta think about the consequences. I just pick up and leave. Sometimes you gotta let it go. It's your pride, baby.